So, you know, just hearing about all the sad stories about, you know, you turn your you turn your head for a second. I mean, even at home, I turn my head for a second and she's in the other room, you know, and that could be her in the pool drowning. The number of children dying by drowning isn't going down, it's rising. Welcome to Florida Focus, I'm Courtney Patterson. Almost 90 children in Florida have died as a result of drowning this year. That's according to the Florida Department of Children and Families. Reporter Mackenzie Musket shows us how a local swimming instructor is helping prevent these deaths. I'm at an infant swimming resource class learning how these kids are staying alive in unexpected emergencies. Liana Brown is an infant swimming resource instructor. She's helping spread awareness of how important these lessons are. A child can drown in a matter of 20 seconds. Um, a parent can be sitting poolside and just turn their head and, and talk to somebody else and the child next to them just slips right under. Brown believes these classes are needed now more than ever. The Florida Department of Health reports that Florida was ranked highest in the U.S. for unintentional drowning deaths among children four years or younger. ISR stands for Infant Swimming Resource. Um, it was started back um, by Harvey Barnett back in 1966, and he slowly developed the program so we could teach young children using sensory motor learning how to, at minimum, swim and roll on their back and float, and maintain that float until help arrives. A perfect way to keep kids safe around the water is having a barrier to, um, to your pool. A four foot high mesh fence is perfect for that. Um, and then make sure it closes either having a self latching gate or a secure lock that a child is unable to open. Rachel Moffitt has been taking her daughter Lexi to ISR lessons. She believes these classes help keep her daughter alive. Children are sponges. They literally can soak up um, how quickly, like, it's amazing how quickly they can learn to swim. So it's, it's really sad to hear when a drowning happens. To learn more about these classes, visit infantswim.com in Newport Ritchie. I'm Mackenzie Musket, reporting for Florida Focus. Thanks for watching Florida Focus. Have a nice evening.